Okay, you have probably been working with square roots and then they put a little three here and it might have been like, what? But we're going to talk about it. First, I'm going to adjust that so it looks a little better. Okay, so you're probably working with square roots. Square root of nine is three, right? Square root of 100 is 10. Because this is asking what number times itself gives me this number, right? Once there's a three there, it is asking me what number times itself, you guessed it, three times gives me this number. Okay. So to find that out, we're going to break it down. Okay. So eight times eight gives me 64, right? Then I'm going to keep breaking these down. So two times four gives me eight, right? This is called prime factorization. Once I get to a number that can't be broken down anymore, I'm going to circle it. Okay. Four can be broken down into two times two. Okay circling those. Okay. Same thing on the other side, right? Two times four gives me eight circled. Two times two gives me four. Okay. Now we are looking for a group of three numbers. Okay. So what this is telling me is two times two times two times two times two times two, times two gives me 64. Okay. So I see a group of three twos, right? So I'm going to pull a two out to the outside. And then here's another group of twos, two, times two, times two, three twos. So I'm going to pull that out to the outside and then there's nothing left, that's all. So when you pull things out, you multiply them together. So two times two gives me four, okay? That is my answer. Four times four gives me 16. 16 times four gives me 64. All right, hopefully that made sense. I will link a playlist with lots of other radical videos if you need them. Thanks.